in a very big way mungano has grown and big national network has happened they have become more meaningful when the country divided their new policy of uh, changing the system i remember mungano changed the style of working into a dialogue you are sitting and talking to the government bureaucracy whether it is municipal co- council or it is uh, all the time whenever i used to come i i don't think we ever anything we have confronted ever but all the confrontation was the on the table sitting on the table negotiate and i should see that there's a very good outcome in the next there will be quite a bit of leaders will emerge from this mungano process they will be part of the developed system they will be part of the i don't know maybe the political bureaucracy without coming on to the street except one or two event where you had a political rallies i remember court case all the time we were all depend on court stay order and things like that that got gone away and the dialogue started coming i think very a good model for even to adopt is the kenyan model where a street the, the the street fighting changed into a dialogue and this is the model emerging from kenya it's quite a lot to do with the mungano process it's predominantly development orientation all the time and dialogue a meaningful dialogue i don't think ever anything is lost in the process you always mood one step ahead one step further you develop a good relation with the bureaucracy and the politicians the model emerging from kenya is a dialogue model in the beginning it was a confrontation when did the confrontation went out of the window and the railway to cover railway was the model for a dialogue one of the court case was there they trying to march people after that there is no march there is no protest march but there was a dialogue so that that is the model contribution for african cities especially to learn from here